Okay, I was on YouTube today, and I noticed that uh, Jim Patero was doing a reading for the sun. And it got me thinking that, you know, I've never um, did an actual tarot reading before. So, I mean, I did a pendulum reading because I lost my cards. But, um, so now I thought I'd take that, you know, take the time to explain, to give you a reading now. Um, okay. So, what we have here, I'm seeing, you have, you want to start something new. And as I say, I think you know who you know what know what it is. Um, but it's going to happen quick, and you want to learn it quick, which is all fine. Yeah, which is fine. Um, but I think you know that uh, time is a major factor. Um, factor in what you want to do. Um, I want to say it's a new skill, what you want, what you want to start a new skill. Um, I'm, I'm being told this by uh, the uh, Two of Pentacles here, um, and the Fool card on the opposite side, uh, which we all know doesn't necessarily mean something bad, but it's simply a new, a blind new journey. Um, followed by the Eight of Wands, which which means uh, haste or quick. Um, the crown is telling me the, uh, the ac acolyte, I can never say that word, the, uh, acolyte, acolyte, I don't know, uh, <laughs> of cups. Um, this is one, like, this deck, I don't, I'm not too good with this deck, so I really don't know exactly, you know, what it means. Um, but I think it means a leap, the book is telling me a leap towards something, a new experience, because as you can see, you know, Dolphin is jumping. Um, so yeah, a new beginning of a new skill, I want to say. And you want to go head on because that you're crossed by the uh, chariot. Um, but don't hit it head on is what this is telling me. Um, take it slow and steady. It will happen quickly, but it could be just the perception it happens quickly. Um, and yeah, the. Like I said, you know it's going to take time because I have the time card here. Um, and people, for the outside influences, want you... I want to say people want you to not do it. They're praying that you just... You don't take that step. I don't understand why. This is the Ten of Swords here. Um, in the picture, really, this woman has just been uh, burned. For being a witch, of course. And the people around him are just bowing and beg and... Uh, She's dead, of course, that's her spirit. And people are uh, all around praying to her, on their knees praying to her that she passes. Um, I could give you the, real, the little definition of, if it, makes you, if it helps any. Um, defeat, loss, or desperation. I mean, like I said, people don't want you to, to do it. Hopes and fears. You want it to work out, but you fear it won't. You know what I'm saying? You hope it, you hope it works. It helps for you. Um, a new skill. I want to say you might want to learn a new form of divination. Um, because I guess a new skill, people generally don't want you to do it. That's what I want to guess. Ultimately, I have the five of wands up here. And it's it means that... Um, let me see the card here real quick. Um, of course, I'm sure you already know what the Five of Wands means. <coughs> um, re repression, I don't, can't get my word out for this one. It, uh, I'm getting that, um, the, um, combat, struggle, um, defending what is important. Um, it's going to be a struggle. And you want to obtain what you want. Therefore, you're going to go everything full steam ahead, and you're going to try it. Um, take a little bit of... Uh, clarify a little bit here. Um, the Mother of Cups and the Sage of Swords. 
I don't ever, um, I don't think you ever said you were a Wiccan, but if I could explain real quick. We have a mother and a father. The mother of emotions and the father of skill. Um, if you want to look at this in a deity concept, the father of skill would be Lu, the uh, Celtic god of activity and creation, or uh, of uh, activity, basically. And the mother of cups would be generally... I'm feeling towards uh, of a of, of Athena. She's a very strong woman, but she's very emotional. She always was connected with her heroes. But two people generally are going to help you with this. Um, in the skill section and in the emotional. You're going to have to have help fighting against it, and then you're going to have help coping with how people are treating you, you know? And so, basically that's your reading for you. Um, I'm sorry I never knew I got one to you, I just realized. So, yeah, you got lucky two readings for today. Um, so yeah, hope everything works out wonderful for you, and uh, blessed be.